Hi everyone, Michelle here and welcome to the Daily M. We had such a great weekend. Saturday we celebrated beautiful day, free yoga in honor of our former manager, Chris Cannavaro, who passed away from brain cancer in June 2015. I had read a poem to the class at 10 a.m., which was a take from a famous poem called Man in the Glass. And uh, when I asked if anyone had heard of that poem, no one raised their hand and I thought that was alarming. Man in the Glass is a poem you need to know and I'd like to read it. But one of the things I wanna share with you is that it validates that through the test of time, the most important thing in your life is your life. Bikram says it. What is the most important thing in your life? It's your life. So the fight worth having, the struggle worth having is the one that is building your character, the one that is investing in your moral compass, um, the one that is uh, validating what you do, uh, why you do what you do, so that you're always in pursuit of the you that you know yourself to be, a man in the glass. When you get what you want in your struggle for self and the world makes you a king for a day, just go to the mirror and look at yourself and see what that man has to say. For it isn't your father or mother or wife who judgment upon you must pass. The fellow whose verdict counts most in your life is the one staring back from the glass. We have that in yoga. Some people may think you a straight shooting chum and call you a wonderful guy, but the man in the glass says you're only a bum if you can't look him straight in the eye. He's the fellow to please, never mind all the rest, for he's with you clear up to the end. And you've passed your most dangerous, difficult test if the man in the glass is your friend. You may feel, you may fool the whole world down the pathway of years and get pats on the back as you pass, but your final reward will be heartache and tears if you've cheated the man in the glass. Boy, isn't that what we're doing in the yoga room, right? How many of us can say that we're honestly best friends with ourselves. One last thing, I kept this. This is about the Washington Monument in Washington, D.C. that was built uh, around 1900s and they had found some graffiti uh, that they believe was written between 1854 and 1880. Think about the test of time. The most important thing in your life is your life and I'll end with this. This is the graffiti statement that they found. Whoever is the human instrument under God in the conversion of one soul, erects a monument to his own memory more lofty and enduring than this. It's your temple, everyone. So you're creating your own monument that you want to have a legacy for. So most important thing in your life is your life. So don't cheat that man in the glass. Thanks for listening.